episode on how I know your neighborhood series. I'm super excited to be here with you guys. And hey, I want to say to you to get ready because today I want to show you a particular neighborhood that is closer to you than you expect. Yes. And again, one thing about this particular neighborhood is that it is popular. A lot of you know the name, but you do not know the exact location where this neighborhood is. In fact, I am sure that you are sure that where it is located is not where it is located. Okay, did I get to confuse you? That is the reason why you need to watch this video to the very end because today I'm going to be revealing to you the exact location of this particular neighborhood. And hey, you will be thanking me for bringing this to your screen in the, at the comfort of your home or your office. So, get ready, fasten your seatbelt because your pilot good assessment is ready to take you guys on this journey and hey you're gonna enjoy a no turbulence flight all the way okay for you to enjoy the journey you have to watch the video to the very end so i'm going to see you guys yes you watching me right now at the end of this video ladies and gentlemen this is the ogombo road inward um, abramadisaya estate the junction so going straight is leading you into ogombo or okumaja but i'm not gonna go to ogombo today i'm going inside lucky scheme too yes like i said earlier eh? many of you don't even know where the lucky scheme too is a lot of people think that is the kate area or etc etc well this is the major entrance into lucky scheme 2 which is invariably can be called lucky phase 2 right so we have a major entrance here now lucky scheme 2 is quite large and big they have different entrance you can come in from different routes actually you can come in from the other part of aja this is where you're, we're going in from today this is the major entrance um, because of interference, I cannot show you guys, but if you, if I tint down, 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 come down a bit, you'll see it. Hey guys, like to see it, let your skin too. Anyways, so we're going to go through this entrance. We're going to go through this entrance and then I'm going to show you guys as much I can show you the part of Lekin Skin 2. I can show you the entire Lekin Skin 2 in one video and this is because it is a very big estate like i said with many routes into it and have a lot of routes um, we have a lot of entrance into this particular the estate so yeah very structured that's one of the things i love so much about um this estate you have the road inter interconnected together there's so much so much um interconnection the road is very very much um, structured as you can see for yourself so they're all connected together okay so let's just keep going so like i said i can't take you guys through everything because it's quite big right so um i'm getting to a t-junction now that we can go either left or right okay so i'm gonna go right in this case i'm not gonna go left um for the sake of this part i'm gonna go just right now and then show you where is this part so you can definitely go right you can link um this part of you can come into this um lucky skin too by um i'm trying to remember the name the popular name we call it elijah yes yeah, called elijah and come in through this part through elijah okay in fact when there's traffic people go through elijah and ladies and gentlemen i would like to point out this is the edifice of landmark wait, realty limited right there their new edifice right here yes this is the edifice the new edifice i just passed it okay so we're gonna go straight down but before i go straight down i want to show you guys what we have here right so if you you can exit from here now this road there's an exit this is exit only this is what you're seeing right now is an exit only okay so that's it just an exit only right there so yeah all right that's an exit only an exit from there 
and then of course you can keep going straight down okay so let's just keep going straight down let's keep going straight down straight down so you keep going straight down like i said i can't show you guys everything he's just interlocked uh, he's big and he's interwoven um yeah he have a lot together and see 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 yeah the roads are mapped up very very well are mapped up very well so it's easily can easily navigate and connect to its parts so yeah so let's just keep going straight down um sorry there's a bed that is really distracting me here sorry um there's a lot of hazards when it comes to doing this road network for you guys because the birds are very territorial <laughs> yes birds are very territorial so anytime they see a drone they feel like they feel attacked i think anyways this is another another road okay and of course within this estate there are estates so there are estates within the estate it's a very large community like i mentioned earlier it's big it's big with various um entrance and still very much populated so i'm going to take you guys straight down to eat another uh, major junction and then from that major junction um i'll show you another entrance and then we'll probably just call it a day because um the birds in this area are truly truly territorial they're more <laughs> they're more stubborn <laughs> if i if i'm allowed to use that word they are more stubborn very very territorial oh my god there's quite a lot of them okay all right let's just keep going sorry i i mean i'm i'm doing the voice as i'm alive okay so i have to just keep talking about it as we go all right if you guys take a note here you see that they are working on a drainage here um they just started working on the drainage a couple of weeks ago so yeah there was a drainage working here um some parts when there's um when it rains you have water on the roads but they, they kind of just move quickly okay like you see where i'm approaching now there's water on the road okay so like his skin too is very big like i said um because of these birds, I can't really go too up and show you guys what we have. So here, this T junction that I've got into now is this is a school. It is actually a popular school. Um, yeah, it's a popular school. Um, something Stevens was it again? Um, Lawrence Stevens is here. Those of you who know about it, this is Lawrence Stevens. Anyway, we're not here to talk about Lawrence Stevens. This is a major road. Now this road will connect you to. Um, um what did i mention earlier i beg your pardon guys um it will lead you to moby road that i mentioned earlier but we're not talking about moby road let me go to this axis and show you guys what we have right now so if you can see um what we have here here you can lead to ogombo this will take you all the way to ogombo is yes straight down is ogombo i mean you get to the um, ogombo abraham this one your road mark so it means that if you didn't take the entrance that i just showed you now you can enter via this part okay you can enter from here so if you're coming from Okwaja and you need to go into lekki skin so you can come in from this part that i'm just showing you guys now so yeah you see so you guys see the Ogombo road already i've got into the Ogombo road you guys see it you see this is another turning and we have two more two more turning so this is by my this part they're going to a bombo. You see it? You see it? Towards um um what's it called now? Aragon Terrace is for those of you who know. And then this is going back to Abramadisoya parts. Okay, so we're going to be going back to where I'm coming from. Uh, <laughs> missing, missing, Dr. Jesus. I'm going to go back to where I'm coming from. See. So yes, going back to facing the road that I showed you guys earlier, um, I was saying that those that live in Megamon, they access the back gate from here as well. So this is a road that links to many other estates 
aside the lucky skin school um lucky skin to itself i beg your pardon yes aside that they have a lot of estates a whole lot of estates on this road so through val this road you can you can connect so many estates so invariably this is a very busy internal road but all of the spaces you're seeing is lucky um scheme two there are within lucky scheme two as you can see right now so yeah so if i go straight down um it will eat other places if i go straight now okay but this is what we're going to do i'm going to just go up and then converse converse the entire area Can you guys see how well structured the entire place is how i mean from the top view you guys can see how structured the entire um place is okay i guess see apart from this road network i'm showing you can see how the internal road is all structured so like it's going through is pretty much very very much structured and and yeah it's not as busy as some other places you still see quite a number of empty lands can you guys see there's a whole lot of empty land around here a whole lot a whole lot and you find that most of the land here has c of o more of c of o land is what you will see here because of course it's a government scheme right it's a government scheme and the history is quite long it's a big one a lot of people bought this land and they didn't get the allocation on time there's so lot so so much so much that happened in terms of delayed of allocation here um for those that know the story you know what i'm talking about anyways um because of the delay of allocation according to the story we read you um they say it's, the development team was not this was not as fast as it should have been but more but the interesting thing is the fact that it's been structured by the government they have drainages in some part or all that so this part i'm showing you guys that it's still the part that are not very busy when we go to the second part when we do the next batch you will see that you have more busy area so i move on saying you have more busy parts you will see i rather oh god i'm sorry i'll be able to show you guys the more busy parts of this uh lucky um scheme to so to speak so yeah ladies and gentlemen if you look very very much further you will see that they have the busy parts we have a lot of the um busy parts ahead of us right now and you can see you can you can see our head so like i said i won't be able to you know take you guys through everything because the spill is quite big and i'll continue i'll do a second version on another time but um thank you so much for doing this with me um we have a fire station around somewhere here um somewhere ahead yes it's ahead the fire station is the red brick you're seeing right there and so i'm going to pick it up from the fire station area and then go to show you guys the built up area but for now this is the only part i can show you guys there's also a strong wind wind right now aside from the beds so unfortunately i would love to converse the entire area show you guys more but for now i can't do more than what i've just done to i'm um, show you guys so what do you think about lucky's game too i mean lucky face too basically what do you guys think do you know anything about lucky's face too do you have a property around here what do you think put it in the comment section let's know your thoughts about this particular um particular area like i said he links to ogombo and he have access to kwaja aziz and all of that this is a very beautiful um beautiful environment and calm okay it's peaceful and land are not very cheap around this particular area so thank you so much guys for doing this with me remember my name is kidness usman and of course um lucky skin too is a close proximity to paragon to pig bay but paragon is closer to lucky skin too it's less than about five minutes drive or let's say between now it's a five five to seven minutes drive from where i am right now is paragon actually and then of course assessing Okwaja, people places like pig bay is less than let's say about 20 minutes let's say like 20 minutes from here you will get to pig bay so if you're interested in buying property in Okunwaja, we have in Paragon, there's still a lot of land for sale, there's houses. In Pig Bay, there's um, land for sale as well. Of course, all of these lands are sea of old land, guaranteed sea of old land. And for Paragon, people are living there already and you can start building immediately. You get your instant allocation 
and start building immediately. So thank you so much. I'll be waiting for your call. I can help you own property in these two estates I just talked about. But if you have any other one in mind, how about you just call me and let me help you with it. Thank you for doing this with me today. My name, of course, remains Goodness Usman, and I am the Queen of Landlord Metal. Of course, you're one and only pilot. Honestly, I've been dealing with the wind so much today. I have to come down at this point. Yes, we have to land here, ladies and gentlemen. I'm gonna see you guys at our next, uh, next, next, next flight. I hope you, uh, you guys kind of enjoy your flight. Did you? Did you? Did you? Huh. <laughs> okay. All right. Um, all right, ladies and gentlemen, this is it. Your favorite pilot. Thank you for doing this with me today. I hope it's been a beautiful, beautiful flight so far. So I'll see you guys when you decide to join us again. But for now, I'll say to you guys, what the?